of time. <laughs> Candid whispers tell your tale. Eyes lock in, focusing beyond words to another time and place, oblivious to ticking clocks, setting suns, rising moons. Life drains into puddles, streams, rivers, and oceans, lost in the watery grave of lost sailors. Time runs out as sands fall through your hourglass. Washing up in some foreign shore, memories stick to the grains of sand. Another may take them home, or unwittingly brush them away. Sunsets leave you behind. Moons cry. Time forgets. Okay, this is, this is um, about a friend of mine that I met years ago. She was from Bournemouth, England. And she had a knack for creating a lot of blue air around her. If you know what I mean? She's, she used very colorful language. So, and my, my nickname was Lulu, so I, I wrote this for her just as a, a fun thing. This is from her perspective. I've gone through my life always swearing and loudly and rudely declaring. I'll curse if I want, then bad, bad language I'd flaunt, then shout why the hell are you staring? <laughs> and then one day I met Lulu, and she said, I can see right through you, so stop all your swearing, it won't stop me caring. And she taught me what not and what to do. <laughs> So cursing I learned doesn't pay, but it took me four score in a day. So for the sake of humanity, I gave up profanity, but now I've got F all to say. <laughs> <laughs> <Man>. <laughs>